What do you hear? What do you say? This is Vertigo bringing you another live commentary video in the blocky world that is Minecraft. And as you can see, I've been doing a little bit of work behind the scenes. You guys left me a lot of tips on my last video, especially about my farm and how I could optimize the growth. So I completely overhauled the farm design, I dug trenches in between the crops, filled them with water to help the crops become more moist than ever. I also added fences to uh, protect the farm from creepers. I learned that creepers are those green dudes uh, and they're dangerous. I don't want them anywhere near my crops, so the fence is going to come in handy. And then I dug this second trench around the farm, and that is where we're going to start today. So this trench is going to be my pathway. I'm going to fill it up with either cobblestone or gravel, and it's just going to create, you know, a nice functioning walkway around my house. And uh, it's just going to add a little bit of flavor and just make it look more homely. Not bad. I like it. Nice, look at that, that's looking absolutely gorgeous. This place is finally starting to look like a home now. I'm really liking the look of it, looking very homely, very glorious if you ask me. But, you know, we still need to add a lot to it, it's got a long way to go. I still want to get horses, I need to get pigs, chickens, we, we need to go back down to the mine again, which I'm kind of nervous about, but excited about at the same time. Alright, so I got these rails from my last episode and the cart. I want to use these to get into the mine. I'm not sure whether or not they can go downstairs, but we're going to test it out because if I can get a mine cart in and out of this mine, that's going to save me a lot of time because walking up these stairs is a real hassle. So let's put the rail on this side. Let's say it starts here. So we'll just put it along. And hopefully this goes downstairs. Oh! Oh, it does! Oh, this, okay, this is, this is amazing. I'm not sure how rare these rails are, but I feel like I was really lucky coming across one of those abandoned mines, because this is going to save me. Yep. Was that the Predator? Oh, it's just Minecraft being Minecraft, I guess. Alright. Let's test this out. Let's put the cart there. What could possibly go wrong? Oh boy, here we go! Holy! This is amazing! Woo -hoo -hoo -hoo! Okay! That's amazing! Up we go, come on, please work. Damn it! I feel like we need more build-up, we need more speed, otherwise it's not going to make it up there. Alright, we're moving. Really, really slowly. And... no. How the hell does this work? Okay, because I can't get the minecart working just yet, I have built a staircase all the way down the mine shaft so we can go in and out a lot faster than we could before. I do feel like the minecart is going to work and there is a way for it to go uphill, but I just don't know yet. So until then, the staircase just has to do. But we're not going to go into the mine shaft just yet. We're going to do some farming. All right, boys, you ready for your shear? Huh? That's it. Nice and easy. Nice and easy. We bring in a few sheep. We've got quite a few now. We've got one, two, three, four, five sheep in total. No, six. Hey, buddy. Forgot about you. Who the hell are they? Ah! Every, every time, man. Every. No, 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 guys, guys, guys. No, don't go to it. No, no, don't go to it. Damn it. Okay, hold on. I just gotta get some wheat. Give me a second, boys. God damn creepers. Where'd I put the wheat? Where'd I put the wheat? Wheat, wait, 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 wait. There. Hey, sheep. Over here. Get away from those guys. They don't look friendly. Come on. Back in the pen. We're going back in the pen. Hey, get back over here. Come on. Alright, I know guys, I know, I know. We didn't lose any of you, did we? I think I had five, right? You guys alright? You, you know I love yous, right? You guys look absolutely adorable. Here, you know what? Ha have babies. Have babies, there you go, have babies. Go ahead, you do your thing. 
More sheep. The more sheep, the better. That has to go do other things now. You guys be careful, all right? Roam around and eat grass. Ooh, the crops are looking juicy. We could probably collect that. Yeah, this is definitely ready to harvest, I think. And then plant. That's, that's, that's the way you professionally farm. Bing, 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 bong. All right. That's a successful farm right there. Hey, what are you doing out of the pen? I did have a sneaky feeling that one got away. Come on, come on. Come on, the sun's going down, I gotta sleep. I ain't got all day. craft heaps of bread. This is gonna be so good. Plenty of bread. We've got a lot of seeds. Actually got way too many seeds. I wonder if we can craft things with that. Probably not, but let's store it in the box. These guys are still hanging around down there. What the hell are they? So I'm gonna go to sleep. If these creepy guys are still there in the morning, I think I'm gonna go down there and force them to leave because that's what I do. I don't let anybody come in here in a threatening manner and aim some kind of weaponry at me. That's just not gonna do. So we're gonna go to sleep and tomorrow we're gonna kick some ass. If they're there. Which they're probably not gonna be. Because they probably saw that I was a manly man when they looked upon my eyes. <sighs> okay. We have to get rid of them. We can't just let them hang around here. They look threatening as hell. They can't be friendly. They're looking right. Look at the death stare they're giving me. All right, fellas. I've given you enough time to leave my property, and you don't seem to want to do that. So, we have to do this the tough way, the hard way, the physical way, the violent way. Ha, 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 ha. Hey, I can do war cries too, okay? Actually, in fact, I'm known for my amazing war cry, and you're about to hear it in spades. Right now. Attack! Dead! Boom! 360 no scope! Give me your arrows, you son of a. Holy hell! There's an army! Hey! What are you guys up to? Look at them all. If I only had an explosive, I could throw it down there and blow them up. That'd be so glorious. Wait a minute. I've got an idea. Now, you guys didn't see this, but I had some lava uh, in a bucket that I had to pour out to put the water in the farm here. Now, I poured the lava over here somewhere. I think it was here. I think I buried it. Yeah, perfect. So I'm gonna grab this, and we're gonna dump some lava on their heads. All right, guys. I've taken all I can steams, and I can't steams no more. You die now. Oh, it's happening. Hurry up, lava. You die. You die. Yes, yes. I'm a genius! I'm a genius and you're stupid NPCs! <laughs> oh! Da. In you go! In you go! What did you, what did you drop? Okay, so I placed the banner that they dropped right behind me here, just in front of my mineshaft. It is to signify my glory over the heathens. Now they know what I'm all about and hopefully they never come back. But I got some unfinished business. I got to go back out and find myself a horse. I still got my saddle. So that's what we're gonna do right now. We're gonna head off and hopefully find ourselves a pony. 
So look what I found. I had no idea this was in the game. It seems to be an NPC village of sorts. And the NPCs are friendly. They just sort of make weird noises. Ah. Just like that. But what's even cooler is they got one of these guys. Look at this dude. A massive iron giant robot thing that I guess protects the village. Dude, I'd pay you well if you want to come back to the vert farm. Oh, this guy looks different. Can I right click on him? Oh, oh, he's a trader. Emeralds for string? This guy, he looks different as well. Let me talk to him. Oh, he ah. wants wheat for emeralds. I got so much wheat, bro. Ah. Oh, okay. All right, so we can trade. But what are emeralds for? I got no idea, but I want them in my life. Oh my God, it's a kitten. Hey, no, no, no. Hey, I got meat. Want meat? Meat? Hey, come get some meat. Come on, come on. Come on, kitty. Eat. I guess I'm like the meat. Maybe he likes fish. Come on, fishy, 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 fishy. Wait for it. Any sec. There we go. Oh, I got a fish. I got a, a, a. Salmon! Woo! All right, I gotta head back to the village, see if this cat even cares about the fish. If he does, we might better take a cat home. All right. Okay, there's the cat. I hope he likes the fish. Do you like fish? Do you like fish? Come on, come on, no, 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 don't run away from me. I've got some fish for you. Fishy. <gasps> he ate it. He ate it. Okay, all right. Maybe another fish? Do you like puffer fish? You want some puffer fish in your life? Come on! Puffer fish didn't hurt anybody. Eh! Eh! Eat the fish! Come here! I just want to be your friend! Don't get any of the creepy, you moron! Oh, come on, man. I just want to be your buddy, your pal. Stop running away from me! Eat it! Okay, fine. Over the salmon. <gasps> Wait. Best friends forever. What is that? What is it? Did I, did I do it? Is he mine? Come on. Are you coming to me? Are you following me? <laughs> Here it is. Home sweet home. Hey, boys. Look what I got. We got, a little, we got a little cat living with us now. Come on, Artax. It's a new day, and I've decided that we're going to begin the construction of the Sphinx. Here's the construction site. I'm going to place this bell, which I stole from the uh, NPC camp. D don't worry about it, they didn't care. I'm now going to ring the bell to signify the beginning of the Sphinx. Construction. Attempt. First thing we need to do is we need to create a nice flat surface that is clear of any obstacles. Okay, it's a pretty clean, flat area. I'm gonna have the Sphinx facing this way. That way it's facing the sunrise and the sun will set behind it. I'm thinking the best strategy to start this is just doing the outline. Don't judge me, okay? This could look completely awful. Don't judge me. I'm going to try my absolute best, though. Nice. I think I got the basic shape. Let me just put some torches down. It's going to be nighttime here in a moment. Now let's have a look at it from above. Okay. Hmm. <sighs> I think I think the pores at the front need to be longer. So I'm gonna have to dig out the sand over here and just extend them out a little longer. Well, you guys got what you wanted. This is definitely gonna be challenging, but you know, at least we kind of got the beginning shape.
Alright, so the shovel broke. Um, so we have to go back and make another one. Alright, I've got a couple more shovels now to dig out that sand. Come on, buddy. Great. So it moves. Okay. The orb box is still there. I'm going to assume I still can't damage. Yeah, can't damage. Can't open the door. Won't let me. Won't let me activate the switch. Can we build up on top of it? Oh, we can. Here we go. Okay. Wait a minute. Maybe I can... If I can build here... No, it won't let me place that. Okay. It's got windows there. Let me let me just come to the windows. There, okay. Jump. Okay, window. Can we break this? No. This is re Maybe I can dig under it. Maybe this is the solution. Okay, we'll just keep digging this way. Yeah, hold on, Artax. I'll be there in a second. It should be under it, right? Okay, alright, so it's only there. What the hell? It moved. I saw it move. What on earth is going on around here? I don't know where it went, but hopefully it's away from my home. Okay, so I've done the basic outline for the Sphinx. I'm pretty happy with it. Uh, it's a good starting point. It doesn't mean it's going to be good, but the basic shape and size and scope of it is very important. So it's a good start. I'm going to take a short nap, uh, wake up in the morning, go back over there, and uh, maybe just iron out a little bit of details, and I think that will probably do us. Oh, no. Why? 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 Well, now it's looking down at my Sphinx. I'm not going to get discouraged. I'm going to continue building. First thing I want to do is uh, do the paws. I think that would be the easiest thing to do. I'm just thinking how we can do this to make it look like paws. I guess maybe I can do like that. And it kind of looks like paws, right? So I'll put them up like that. Yeah, yeah, okay. Yeah, that looks like... A about right, I think. Uh, yeah. So like that. Yeah, it looks like a paw. I think I think that's pretty cool. We also want the the thumb to be like here. Now are they both the same? Yeah, they look about the same. Now we don't. I don't want to use all my stones. So I'm going to use some sand to fill in some gaps that I'm not going to use. Nice. That's looking really good. I like that. All right. Yes. <laughs> yes, hello. How are you? I'm all right. What do you want? Uh, I was just looking at your uh, bell here. Yes, it's a bell. What about it? I really like it. It's the construction site bell. So unless you're constructing, okay. you have no right to touch my bell. Okay. I have a question. Why does that creepy building keep following you everywhere? Yeah, that's a good question. You think I know? I mean, tr I tried to dig under it, and as I was digging under it, it it disappeared, and then I came over here to work on the Sphinx, and... Could you please stop ringing the bell? I've, be I've begun construction. What do you think? I think, uh, your paws look pretty good. Yeah, I thought so too. I'm actually pretty proud of them. It's, uh, it's gonna take a long time to do this, but I think I'm gaining confidence. I think I might be able to do it. I have every bit of confidence in you as well. Oh, thanks. Uh, this is gonna be a lot of sandstone, you know? Yeah, I know. I know it is, but I, I've got plenty of it. Okay, can you, can you leave me uh, to to build? Thank you. Appreciate it. I'm so cute. Look at me. You're no, in I my way. Get out of my way, God damn it! Okay. Tata -ta and farewell. All right.
I thought I might fail the Sphinx, but I think it is possible that I could create a wicked looking Sphinx. What the hell is that? Ah! Oh, shit! Oh, oh, son of a 